Wow, a little on edge. Sorry, Velma. Like we haven't eaten since the snack after lunchtime snack. Shaggy, Scooby, you guys are going to love me. The Keystone Castle International Food Festival. Food Festival? A castle? Sounds like it could be a fun type of vacation. It's beautiful. Look at the amazing scenery. And there's even an eating competition. Scoop, this is like no time for sleeping, man. We've got to start clearing all these shelves. Why do that now? To make room for the trophies we're totally going to be bringing back. I'd really love to go, but I promised we'd help my cousin Anna win her school talent contest. We'll be there, Daph. I've heard St. Louis High has the biggest cafeteria in the state. The biggest? Yum. And cafeterias always have the best customers. Like us. So as much as I'd like to see that castle, can Anna count on us? Totally. With Scoob and my sweet dance moves in her act, she'll get a first place trophy. Then we can go eat our way to ours. <laughs> Time. In the name? Stop, 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 stop! You sound like a mouse, Anna! You must project! And again. In the name of the gods! <laughs> Ms. Hilkin? Is that you? I hope? <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to see Anna. Thanks for helping her out, guys. No problem, Daphne. We're happy to help, right, Scoob? Scooby Dooby Doo! Okay, let's split up. We'll find Anna faster that way. Like, we'll search in this direction. Right, Scoob? <laughs> right. <laughs> if we're gonna dance at Anna's contest, we need to find the cafeteria and fuel up. Sco come in, Scooby. Shaggy, come in. Do you copy? Like we copy, or whatever. Hi, boys. You need to find a way into the school. Anna should be inside somewhere. Like, cool, man. Leave it to us, Velma. Yeah. <laughs> okay, keep me posted. Velma out. All right, Scoob. We've got to be quiet sneaking around here. If a teacher finds us, we're like history, man. Dude, a Scooby medallion. Get it. That's worth like 500 Scooby Snacks. What are you doing back there? We're Shaggy and Scooby, uh, the garden inspectors. Shaggy and Scooby? I've heard of you. I'm Anna. Anna? Like Daphne's cousin? Yeah. We're here to, like, help you win your contest. And I'll need some real help. We haven't been able to finish a single dress rehearsal since the Phantom started haunting the theater. Zoinks! Like, did you say Phantom? Phantom? Yeah, the Phantom of the High School Musical. He keeps terrorizing us whenever we're in the theater. Ms. Hilkin still isn't happy with our performance, and the contest is this weekend. Ms. Hilkin? The drama teacher. Okay, but first, like, if we're gonna go find the food... Oops, I mean, uh, Phantom. <laughs> we need to know. Is there a cafeteria here? Right past that building. But why? Gotta get some energy if we're gonna help you win your contest. <laughs> like my philosophy of life, Scoob. Food... Before Phantom. <laughs> All right, 
to the school eats. No, but like we found Anna. Oh, and, and like watch out for the Phantom. Phantom? Fred? Yellow? Oh, he's gone, Scoob, like a Phantom. <laughs> hey, Scoob, I'm a crackpot. I mean, crack shot. Come over here and like swap to me. Hey, up there, Scoob. Can't you like smell that cafeteria taste? A pressure switch, like over there. Like it's grapple time, man. I can get up there. Scooby, the dog door. Dog, door, you, go, me, Sloppy Joes. Oh, man. The food's like down this hole. Back to the drawing board, Scooby-Doo. Uh -oh. I haven't even had dinner, and like I'm already being deserted. We'll never find Anna if we have to search in the dark. Hmm. By the looks of things, that's the power shed right there. The generator should be inside. Jinkies! That switch is huge! See if you can turn it, Fred! those big sports lights on, we'll be able to see a whole lot better. Hmm, maybe I could use that device to turn them on. <laughs> Silly Velma, I need to press the buttons in the right order. Velma, clues. Jinkies, look how many there are. We'll need them all to piece the clue together. <laughs> Daphne, come in. Do you copy? Daphne here. Hi, Velma. The boys found Anna, and apparently we've got a phantom on our hands. Sounds like another mystery. The phantom may be on our hands, but he's missing a glove on one of his. Keep an eye out for clues. When one of us finds a way into the school, we'll all meet up. Okay, Daphne out. Hey, kids! Coach Hayes, Fred Jones. I remember you from when your school used to play ours. Fred Jones, the star quarterback. Your spectacular pass really stole the game away from us, son. <laughs> Sorry, sir, but thanks, sir. So you'll be at the sports carnival this weekend? This weekend? But the talent show's this weekend. <laughs> That's what Ms. Hilkin thinks. Pardon? Ms. Hilkin, the drama teacher. Well, think about it. How do they ever hope to win the talent contest if they can't even finish a dress rehearsal? Yeah, that is tough to do when there's a phantom in the house. Just as well, as far as I'm concerned. My star player is in that show. Hmm. Well, our friend's cousin's in the show, too. So we need to help them get phantom free. Well, a word of advice. Ask Miss Hilkin where she was every time the phantom appeared. Someone has a bone to pick with us.
Check it out. Hey, wait for me. I could get across on that pole. Do I thought you were brave. The gang will be able to get into the school. <laughs>
Good work, guys. Come on, Scoob. Gotta find those clues. Clues? Right, clues. Sure, Shaggy. Velma, come in, Velma. This is Velma. Over. 
We found a clue in the library, and I think it belongs to someone you know. It's a whistle. A coach's whistle. Exactly. Chinkies? We'll keep looking. If the Phantom is Coach Hayes, Miss Hook is the only one who can confirm our suspicions. We need to find her. Right. Found anything interesting in the science rooms? Nope. Not yet. Okay. Daphne out. I don't think so. My mistake. Kind of fun. Hey, watch the hair. Called Scooby Snacks. We have to pull the rubbers at the same time.
I don't know about this snooping backstage. We could get in trouble. Relax, Daphne. No one will be here this late. <laughs> <laughs> to be back here what are you doing we're trying to help we're looking for clues to keep the show from being haunted you must be miss hilkin that's right the drama teacher here 22 years now so you've heard of our disturbances anna's my cousin we're worried about her well that phantom has been a big nuisance we were told you were never around when he shows up uh well <laughs> So, Miss Hilkin, the Phantom's around, and Ms. Hilkin isn't. That sure doesn't sound like Ms. Hilkin. Anna told me she used to be a prize-winning actress. She even won a golden square. Don't you think it's strange that Ms. Hilkin disappears every time the Phantom's around? Yeah, a little too strange if you ask me. <laughs> Velma, come in, Velma. It looks like we have a new prime suspect. We just met Ms. Hilkin, and gee, was she a strange one. Quit too.
in, like the curtains closed on this musical. Oh, Case! What? But where's Ms. Hilkin? Right here. She was just scared. Not me. Whenever I thought the Phantom was around, I ran to protect my most precious possession. A golden square. I won for the performing I used to do. I predict someday Anna will have one too. But why did the coach do it? Simple. For the love of the game. He knew he needed a full team to have a chance at winning this weekend's game. So like he sabotaged the show. Exactly. Then the coach hooked himself up to the wiring in the theater, making it look like he could fly. And I would have gotten away with it if it weren't for you meddling kids. Well, it sounds like his next play will be a gripping courtroom drama. And the school is finally scarce of scares. Scooby dooby doo! Scooby-Doo! <laughs> 